I'm Ruby Grace Loxton, <laughs> and my birthday's this week. I'm turning eight, and um, I'm going to talk about my emotions and how I can control them. So this is actually the hill that I write down when I'm angry. So I just get on the scooter, which is over there, uh -huh. and I go down that big, long downhill, and it's really fun. Except not. But, um, so that's what I do when I'm, like... When you're angry. really angry, you like to yeah. go out and, yeah. and ride your scooter, ride a bike. And sing. And sing. Yeah. <laughs> All right. And so what else do you do? We talked about on the podcast, we talked about when you are angry, you'll, you'll oftentimes you'll sing. Um, yeah. And you also, you started that with your Daniel Tiger, Tiger yes. song. Can you do that one real quick? When you feel so mad that you wanna <laughs> take a deep breath and count to four. One, two, three, four. That's right. Breathing is another thing you do. You often yeah. do that when you're really angry. Yeah, that's when I'm in the middle of like public and I don't really want to sing it without my lungs and be like Yeah, then you'll do you'll <laughs> do breathing. And then another thing that you'll do is um is mom. Oh, a reset. Reset. So I go into the back room and I just take time to be by myself and be helpful with myself. And I get to be and get everything right so I actually know what in the world is going on with my emotions. Right. And what about um, what about when you're sad? When I'm sad, like I said um, on the in the podcast, is I usually think about what I'm grateful for. Yeah. That's also what I do when I'm scared. You so. focus on gratitude. Sometimes but you also said another thing that you do is you think about whether you're a victim or not. Yeah. Um, that's, like, I've had lots of um, things that I wish I didn't do, and sometimes I've acted like I was a victim, like acted like I was Rapunzel. Uh-huh. And um, that... And I had to think about that. And for was it helpful? Months, no, it wasn't helpful, and it just hurt some people's feelings. So I thought about that for a while, and then I found out it's not the right thing to do. So I helped um, myself learn how to stop it. To stop it and to think of what you are in control of, right? Yeah. What things you can do and work on that. And then when you're scared? When I'm scared, like I said, I think about happy thoughts. Because if I know that I'm safe and I'm in control and hopefully nothing's going to kill me. So um, <laughs> yeah, I do that and it can help me calm myself down. That's right. Thank you, Juliet, for sharing how you navigate your emotions. Yep. Because it's good to let all of those emotions come in and flow through and then choose which ones we want to stick with and yeah. hold on to a little bit longer and feel. Which is yeah. happiness. Happiness. So we're wishing you joy and happiness today. Happiness. Namaste.